Almarante Aves, GCSE Spanish School, be able to talk about school uniform. Here we go. Number one. Do you have to? Now, so we need an upside down question mark straight away. So, let's take this one here, uh, copy it, and put it in like so. Yes. So, do you want to, or do you have to, sorry, is TNS uh, K. So, TNS K. Now, to where is uh, Yevar? Okay, and then uniform. Don't need an A there, just put uniforme. Now, um, wearing a uniform is optional. So, literally, is optional. Uh, S. Now, we got this word here. Opti. Okay, so we got optativo, like so. Optativo. Um, wearing uniform is Yevar. Okay, and then uniform is uniforme. So what we need to do is just cut this and let you go. Okay, let's just put that over here and paste it in like so. So it, it is optional to wear a uniform. Right, number two. Now we wear. So ye bar is to wear, so ye bamos. Okay, um, so the we form, amos there. So get rid of that. Um, uniform, uniforme, so llevamos uniforme, and then at school, okay, with different ways of doing this, we use instituto here, so en el instituto, okay, to, right, but, pero, so you got pero, um, it is, now it is, is uh, s, and then super feo is super ugly, like so. Right, number three, now, our is nuestro. So you've got nuestro uniforme S. So our uniform is. Now a red jumper is literally so we got un jersey like this and then red is rojo. So the adjective, the colour coming afterwards. Now grey trousers okay is pantalones. Okay, so you've got pantalones like so and then grey is cabezas. Now, a white shirt, a shirt white literally. So, una camisa. So, you've got una camisa. And then we've got blanca. Now, what, uh, and e and a green tie is a tie green. So, una, una corbata. So, you've got una corbata. And then we got verde green. Okay, so that's number three. Number four. I don't like, no, I like, me gusta, therefore I don't like, no me gusta. So we have no me gusta like that. Now, no me gusta llevar, so no me gusta llevar uniforme. I don't like wearing a uniform because is por qué. It is really ugly. It is very ugly, literally. So es muy and then fio. So you got es muy fio, meaning it's very ugly. E and and then uncomfortable is incomodo. So we need uh, the accent over the O, like uh, not like that. So we do it again until we get the right one. Okay, and it's that one there. Fancy picking the wrong one. So that's number four. Number five. Now I don't mind. Set phrase for that, uh, ladies and gentlemen, is no me importa. No me importa. So, no me importa. It's not important to me, if you like. Llevar. So, no me importa. Llevar. Uh, now, a uniform. Remember to get rid of that. Uh, uniforme. Uh, because, por qué. So, we got por qué, like so. Um, I don't have to. Now, I have to is tengo que. So, I don't have to is no tengo uh, que. Like so, no talking tengo que decidir to decide. Okay, now what is uh, que? So we need uh, que. So make sure you pick the right one. Okay, that is, ladies and gentlemen, the wrong one. Okay, this is the problem on the downside of wearing uh, shades when doing this. So decidir que now to wear. Okay, or to put on myself is poner. Me. So, que ponerme. 
Now, to go to school, in order to go to school, literally, okay, is para, uh, in order to go, ir is to go, the infinitive dictionary form, al instituto, except you want an O. Don't knock your head off, though. Right, uh, number six, the shoes. Fantastic word in Spanish, los zapatos. Okay. Okay, los zapatos. Now, the shoes have to be. Okay, so the shoes have to be. So, tienen. So, tienen que is have to. And then to be is ser. Now, they have to be. Okay, negros. Okay, agreeing with zapatos. So, OS on the end there. Or, um, and then brown is marrones. Uh, like so. Now, it is so old. So, S. Now, uh, so is uh, tan, and then old, we're going to use this word, this fantastic word here, antiquado, which is like the English word antiquated, e, and I hate it, it's I hate, literally, lo odio, so lo odio. Right, okay, there's a worksheet to screenshot if you want to record your answers there, okay, and moving on to number seven. Now, I would like... Fantastic phrase. Me gustaría. Okay, so we need our famous I there. So me gustaría llevar, of course. Now, vaqueros uh, is jeans. Now, every day is todos los días. So todos, los, and then we need uh, días. Okay. Uh, like that, todos los días, but, pero, at my school, now different ways as we said before, in saying at my school, okay, we could use um, this one here instead, en mi colegio, en mi colegio, I have to, now, tengo que, or we could use this phrase here, hay que, as an alternative, hay que llevar, dictionary form still, okay, and then uniform is uniforme. Right, moving on to number eight. Now, in the summer is en verano. En verano, yes. Now, I have to wear, okay, so uh, let's revert back to tengo que. So tengo que, and then llevar is to wear. Now, a striped dress is, uh, vestido is what we need for dress, so un Vestido, actually masculine, okay, okay, and then striped is a uh, rayas, like that. Un vestido a rayas, y, and, now, a dark green cardigan, dark green cardigan is una uh, chacueta, so you got una chacueta, de punto, yes, de punto, it's what it's, it's what you hear, verde, which is green, and then dark is oscuro, if it's masculine, okay, oscura, feminine. Number nine. So, in the winter, so we have in the winter, en invierno, en invierno. Now, we all have to, all we have to, literally. So, you go todos, which is all or everyone, tenemos, so tenemos, we have to, put the K in to show we have to. Yebar, so todos tenemos que llevar. We all have to wear now grey trousers. Yes, so unos uh, pantalones. So pantalones, and we had grey before. Uh, grises y now a yellow sweatshirt. Una sudadera, lovely word. Suda and then dera. Okay, and then we need uh, yellow is amarilla. Amarillo, if it's masculine. Right, number 10. My uniform is mi uniforme. Es. That's what we have to do here. Elegante. This is magic. And then por qué is because. Now, I wear, present tense, llevo from the verb llevar, and a dark blue jacket. So that's what we need now. So, Una chaqueta, 
Okay, so you got Una Chiqueta, and then we got Azul, which is uh, blue. Okay, and we got that word again. Um, all right, so it's Una Chiqueta, so Oscura. This is feminine, agreeing with Chiqueta. E and now a light blue shirt. So uh, Una. So we have Una uh, Camisa. Now Una Camisa, Azul. Okay, and then it's actually got Claro here, so I'm I'm gonna hedge my bets and change that back to Oscuro. Oscuro is dark, Claro is light. Maybe it doesn't agree with the with the fact that they're feminine, so I need to double check on that. Okay, all right. This is what I did earlier. What is your uniform like? How is your uniform? Let's come as to uniforme. Do you like your uniform? Te gusta tu uniforme? Okay, far too easy to actually uh, go into that one. So normally, normalmente. Now, pupils is los alumnos in now España in Spain, España. Okay, let's just make sure we got that. Yep, there we go. Don't wear. They don't wear. So it's the they form of llevar. So llevan. So no llevan. Okay, uh, a uniform. Okay, is uniforme, but pero. Let's get that right. Now, I go to private school. So, your boy, or just boy. Now, to a private. Now, that is going to be uh, a un. Um, school private, literally. So, we're going to use, this time we use uh, colegio again, which we used before. And then, uh, privado, like that. Okay, so have a good look at this. That is the uh, worksheet to screenshot if you want to record your answers on this one. Okay, and that is the end. Gracias y adiós.